Since 2011, one of the biggest stars on the MLG Pro Circuit has been Scumpy. The Ginger Ninja burst onto the scene at MLG Dallas 2011 when his team Leverage dominated the competition, taking first place. Right now, Scumpy is at four, 11 and 4. He is just absolutely wrecking it right now as he picks up another one against Mainstream, and he is just holding it down hardcore right wow, now. Wow, that's his seventh so far. We need to work on our SMD game. We really came out and we beat Resistance, which is probably one of their best game types, and we really just took control after that. The squad rotated players several times during the course of the year, which allowed Scumpy the opportunity to learn from veteran players like TP, Aix, and Proofy. In Modern Warfare 3, Scumpy joined Apex North America, the team that would eventually become Optic Gaming. Yes, now we are seeing Josh once again. Left last alive against Scump, Rambo, and Merc. This time, one versus three. Needs to do this to keep them in. But no, he has been taken down by Scumpy. So there we have it. Optic Gaming are once again champion. The squad dominated the year, losing only one of the five tournaments they attended. Unfortunately, he was too young to compete at COD XP and had to watch from the sidelines as his teammates won the $400,000 grand prize. Black Ops 2 saw the team place consistently in the top eight, but they would only grab one first place finish at UMG. And they have position on the next to go! Oh, is the Optic winning! And it is it! Complexity! Optic Gaming is a legendary franchise here in, in Call of Duty, but this year you haven't been getting the championships that you know you might have been hoping for. What's been going on over at Optic? And I think the intensity has a lot to do with it. We used to have Ray shot calling. Uh, nobody really does that in search for us anymore. But we still we still win a lot in search, so I don't really think that's a problem. I think intensity is really one of the biggest things as well as hard point. Optic has been struggling in Call of Duty Ghost. Their placings have clearly not matched up to the standards they have set in previous years. However, with a roster full of past champions and an unwavering dedication, underestimating this team could be a fatal mistake.